An ever-increasing number of children are entering schools with life-threatening food allergies. Thus, it is important to know how to recognize an allergic reaction and to be prepared if one happens as they can cause serious and even deadly reactions. The most common foods that cause allergies in kids include milk, eggs, soy, wheat, tree nuts, peanuts, fish, and shellfish. Allergies are caused when the body treats a substance or allergen as harmful and proceeds with an immune response. Every time the person eats, or in some cases even breathes in the food, the body releases chemicals like histamine. This triggers allergic symptoms that can affect the respiratory system, the gastrointestinal tract, the skin, or cardiovascular system. Symptoms can range anywhere from wheezing, vomiting, sneezing, itchy and red eyes, and hives on the skin to more severe symptoms such as anaphylactic shock. People often confuse food allergies with food intolerance because of similar symptoms. The symptoms of food intolerance can include burping, indigestion, gas or loose stools, headaches or nervousness, but they are rarely dangerous. There is no cure for food allergies, but medicines can treat both minor and severe symptoms. Antihistamines can be used to treat symptoms such as hives, runny nose, or belly pain from an allergic reaction and are sold under common over-the-counter medications such as Benadryl. During more severe cases, epinephrine auto-injectors or EpiPens are used to inject epinephrine which acts quickly to improve breathing, stimulate the heart, and increase blood pressure. Because so many schools do not have a full-time nurse, it is essential for faculty and peers to recognize when children are having a reaction and know what emergency steps to take. In fact, a study done by Sampson, Mendelssohn, and Rosen in 1992 found more children were victims of fatal anaphylactic shock at school than at home or another setting. An example of such a situation includes the death of 13-year-old Carnvir Chuma in Greenford, West London on June 28th of 2017. The 13-year-old was severely allergic to wheat, gluten, all dairy products, eggs, and all nuts, was asthmatic, and suffered from atopic eczema. He was chased by a schoolmate who threw cheese down his t-shirt, which eventually led to his allergic reaction and death. When emergency officials were called, the operator was told that it was just an allergic reaction, when in fact, it was a lot more serious than that. If a child starts having serious allergic symptoms, give the epinephrine auto-injector right away. Remember the phase blue to the sky and orange to the thigh. Also give it right away if the symptoms involve two different parts of the body, like hives with vomiting. Then call 911. The child needs to be under medical supervision because even if the worst symptoms seem to have passed, a second wave of serious symptoms can happen. The purpose of this video was to promote food allergy awareness and emphasize the need for shared responsibility to protect these children, and we hope it did just that. In fact, an article by Dr. Green Ha and colleagues identifies the need for empathy, understanding, and objectivity for students with food allergies. For more information on food allergies, you can visit sites such as the Food Allergy Research and Education Network. Thank you so much for watching.